Hi, this is Point and Stew, and I finally got <coughs> this uh, expo to work. This is my target, by the way. Right there, that cushion. But at any rate, <coughs> I'm using a very, very weak blue th uh, TheraBand tubing uh, as a proof of concept. And what is so difficult to do is to use bare TheraBand tubing uh, against a uh, roughly uh, half-inch dowel. With a, it's sort of like trying to hit a baseball with a baseball bat. And the only way I was able to really get it to be reliable is to have the toothbrush as a hold down. And if you notice the green, the green is a piece of plastic used to uh, <clears throat> bale uh, pallets from Home Depot. As a matter of fact, <laughs> it went off by itself. Well, there it is. There's no spring. So that's the whole point. Uh, so let's just zero in on, on, on the mechanism and you'll see. Here's the, uh, the, the pressure that's applied down. And if you notice, it's, it's using the uh, double uh, hook. So that's how it is, and there's no spring. Uh, it went off by itself, which means never point a weapon at anything or go in front of anything where it could go off, and it hit the target. And the thing about why I'm doing this is to see with, with minimum friction how fast, uh, as you can see, this wasn't stretched very much. This is an old TheraBand. It was pulled maybe two to one, but maybe even less. See, it goes up to here to, to, to get to the vise. So, you can see that it's it's about halfway. So with two to one, I'm getting I would consider pretty amazing efficiency. I'm getting 90 feet per second uh, with a measured 13 pound pull for a 300 grain arrow. And that, I think that's pretty darn good. But this is just a proof and. Uh, I basically decided to discard this method and turn the trigger upside down and uh, release released the uh, uh, TheraBand tubing onto the flat plane of the slide. And so there won't be any indecision of where that tubing is going to go. But it took me many, many trials and many, many angles and playing around with the toothbrush, etc., to get this thing to go. So, for what it's worth,